Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing Guess the Black Boyfriend. We have five white girls here and four of them are dating a white man, but one of them is dating a black person. And our job is to figure out who it is. First round, as always, we're going off looks. Let's see who we think off looks is dating a black guy. So can us black guys figure this out is really what we're- Hey, 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 hey. Okay, hold on. Hey, I'm here with my neighbors in Christ. Okay? I, <laughs> I brought Zach in as our in-house white expert to help us, you know, de decipher the ones who are dating white dudes. But I feel like we should figure this out. You're from Wisconsin. Yes, I know about these white women. And I'm gonna tell you right now, this white girl in this Biggie shirt, She's very much given she dates black dudes. I don't know about- She Googled black guy that sings on Amazon right before <laughs> and got next day shipping and threw it on. Zach, the I fact that you said black guy that sings and Biggie is on her shirt. <laughs> Brother, that was the joke. She doesn't even know he's a rapper. Looking at him, I'm gonna tell you right now, <laughs> They don't have numbers on them, but red, we gotta get their names. Red sweater in the middle right here. Yeah. There's a lot of confidence and coolness. Yes. She looks very comfortable. Yes. It's giving black boyfriend, husband. Yes. She could handle that. I will, I will agree with Christian. Mm -hmm. The way the jeans are set up, the swagger, the shoe game in comparison to the other shoes to me is giving black husband slash black boyfriend. Like look, look at the swagger, huh? Right. The swag, yeah, she's- I've always been swaggy. Zach, what do you think? Uh, any of you ladies wear pads? Once a month. Okay, okay, that might be you, because if, if, you, if you date a black man, the tampon would fall out because it would stretch it out a little bit, you understand? And they would, so they wear pads. And that's science. That's what white people do, we do science. <laughs> well, not her. Her? Yo, I don't even have nothing to say after that. <laughs> that was crazy. I, I, my pick early on is, is red. Uh, from the hoop earrings. I almost, I know yours are bigger, but we feel like you did Google all this stuff. And then <laughs> so did he then. I know, I'm, I'm agreeing with the white does, uh Does your husband or boyfriend exclusively wear one color of red as well? No, not necessarily. Okay, he's a blue guy. No, not a blue guy. Definitely not a blue guy. Okay, well let's do this. Let's ask some questions. Let's just dive right into it. We got our picks out the gates. Starting with you, number one. What is your name, where are you from, and what is your boyfriend's name? Hi, my name is Carly. With a K or a C? With a C. Hi, Carly. <laughs> and I am from Texas, and my boyfriend's name is Jordan. Like, I guarantee that's like a light-skinned black man. You think that's so? That's what I'm thinking. Oh, that, is, that, is, that is, that is. Light-skinned yeah. black. Jordan, that's, yeah, yeah, that falls in line with that. When he orgasms, does he make a goat sound? No. It's not Michael. It's not Michael. <laughs> First of all, LeBron the GOAT, so you got that fully wrong. Um, did you meet your boyfriend out here or in Texas? Um, in Texas. How tall is Jordan? 5'11", uh, 6 foot. That's a white man. Does he, did he play any sports in Texas? Um, he played basketball. Oh, he's definitely white. Well, she said it almost like it was a question. Yeah. Basketball? Yeah. Like he, did, he didn't hoop. Yeah. He played basketball. He was the manager. He was on, he was there with the players. Yeah. Number two, what is your name? Where are you from? Uh, my name is Lea. I'm from Ukraine. And my boyfriend's name is Daniel. Daniel? It ain't a lot of black people in Ukraine. But she didn't, I don't know if he found him there. She would have had to find the one black man No, in did Ukraine. you find your boyfriend here in America? Uh, actually, I found him online and then we met in America. So he shipped you over here? I was working in tech, actually in Ukraine, so I had a like, business trip to America and... Sorry, if you guys go to the beach, hmm. does he use sunblock? That's crazy. You know black people use sunblock, right? Not as much, and you know that. I, I, I just don't think a Ukrainian girls are hooking Bro, up with black Bro, she man. met him online. That's even worse, because that means she had to trust him through the internet. What was the, the what? point you made one video about the fact that typically your taste has been developed, what you're around. What you're around. She's around she white people. She grew up people. in Ukraine. That's not how fetishes are developed, it's the opposite. Why are you oh. staring into my soul like this? <laughs> Christian, tired of y'all <laughs> Judge I got a, my, a gynecologist here with real science. You guys are bringing this fake science. My here. sister's in OBGYN, and sometimes she shows me pictures of her patients. Okay, so, no. first of all, is that legal? <laughs> it's like patient confidentiality. I'm BCC'd in. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I just, I think Ukraine meeting a black man online and then going out to date him. I think it's ridiculous you're using that as any kind of reason whether or not she is a black dude. Well, where was your man from? Where he live? Uh, he actually originally from New Jersey, but now we live in LA. Bro, stop it. Camden, come on, bro. What Daniel in New Jersey, you think is a black dude? There's 
Jersey, bro. I know this Jersey, but I'm saying a nigga's named Daniel in Jersey dating girls from Ukraine. Well, it's 2024, man. It's the internet. I'm not buying it, bro. Jim Crow Kevin over here. There's no way she could have met him. All right, number three. I'm Sam with an S. Is there another way to spell Sam that I don't know about? I don't, I just was riffing off of Carly with a C. Black people love to riff. I mean. This is true. Like so <laughs> where, where are you from, Sam? I'm from Texas also. So a lot of black men out there in Texas. What's your uh, boyfriend's name? Richard. Have you ever called him Dick? I mean. You can't with all of it in your mouth, right? Oh my God. <laughs> you gotta chill, bro. We're three minutes into the video. Though. Okay, I would've came twice then. <laughs> <laughs> I call him other things. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Well, I'll just ask because you know. Hold on. Oh, wait. I know. I know. I know what you're about to say. But I want to clarify. You've never called him Dick. Never. Black people don't go by Dick. I don't even know a lot of black people named Richard. My uncle and my grandpa's name are Richard. No, no, no. You're mixed. It's my heart. dad. My, the, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Why would I even reference it? If they weren't black. Sam. Um. No biggie. How long ago did, did you meet Richard in Texas or out here? Out here. We met romantically at a bar. What was what brand of Hennessy was he drinking? Dude, he was a cocaine guy. Oh, wow. He might not be black. That takes me that back. Is, that is our thing. Yeah. Number four, what is your name? Where are you from? Sarah, with an H. <laughs> All right, okay. I'm from Washington. Really You're Washington State? Yes. Mm. My boyfriend's name is True. True? That's How do you spell it, T-R-U? Yeah. That's Whoa. Some That's some black On his ID? Yep. <laughs> black people be doing sh like that. Yeah. How, how does he spell true? T-R-U. That's him. Oh. That's the black dude. That's Sarah, did, did you meet true out here or in Washington? Out here. How long you guys been dating? Five years. Damn. Mm, true. You seem like Number five, on Susie Don Stretching. What is your name and where are you from? My name's Katarina with a K. You say Katarina? Because <laughs> you're moving around a lot. Uh, well, because we don't have chairs. Like, I haven't, I haven't been standing this long. It's going to be much longer than this, baby girls. <laughs> I'm sorry, Kat. We'll get you out of here fast. Oh, yeah. Oh, da dum dum -tsh. And, uh... <laughs> what? She hit with the rim shot. Did you say we're going to get you out of here fast and she made that sound? Yeah, she did. She's funny. Katarina, is that you pronounce it? Yes. With a K, no other way. Ooh! That's yeah, some yeah. black sh be doing that. No, don't, don't. Hopefully there's not two on the end of that. What? He's so fast. Are you listening to this? No. Where are you from, Katarina? Uh, I'm Serbian, but I moved here from New York with my husband, Brooklyn. Brooklyn? Remember that one girl, that Russian girl who had yeah. the baby by the black yeah. dude? She's yeah. giving me that type of So your husband's name is Brooklyn? No, that's the part of New York we moved from. What, what, part, of, what part of Brooklyn were you living in? Flatbush. Oh, they, hey, it's black people over there. Bro. Oh. But, but she's from Serbia. But that's my point. If she was just straight Serbian, she would not be acting like this. She's she had some be. influence from somewhere else. Where'd you meet your, your husband? Uh, we had met at a bounce party in New Orleans. New Orleans, a bounce party. Like bounce, like, like bouncing, biggity, bouncing, biggity, bouncing, biggity, bouncing. It's like bouncing. basically a competition where- Hold on, Katrina. What was that? <laughs> that's the New what Orleans thing. The fuck was that? Yeah. It's, it's the it's the music. Yeah, that's hot. That's the music. Bounce it, biggity, bounce it, biggity, bounce it, biggity, bounce it, bounce it, bounce it, bounce it, bounce it, bounce it. Shout out New Orleans, man. No, 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 no. And that's the only song they be playing. Herm. You talking to white people, dude? You talking to white? <laughs> that's a that's a New Orleans thing. It's a staple. Their music is bounce music. You know what I'm talking about? That's the music they play in New Orleans. I don't know. I can't confirm or deny anything. You have just said. What's your boyfriend's name? <laughs> what What's the bounce party then? What's the husband's name? What's your husband's name? Basically, you want which question you want? What's your ask? husband's name? Who needs to know that All information? Of us. <laughs> <laughs> Katarina, that's you the show. Why do I need to do the information? That's the. Sh you could tell us his nickname. So it could be Latrell. No, it's not. It's Darrell. Darrell. Oh. She, she married to Latrell from the last video. Durrell? <laughs> mm, like, the, the, like the battery. Like the battery. That's Duracell. <laughs> <laughs> she said like the battery. <laughs> <laughs> I hope he didn't introduce himself like that. Durrell, like the battery. Katarina, the, what's your first language? Serbian. I think Sam's boyfriend sold Katarina some of that cocaine. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> okay, we got we got the intro out the way. I feel like we need a. This is not like the other one we can look at them and tell, right? We need yeah. at least one question to get the cracking. Yeah. Let's yeah, let's do a couple okay. questions. And we'll eliminate. Yeah. This well, I have a question they all should answer. Okay. So you guys all have black boyfriends or husbands. What's the thing that like the biggest thing you've learned because you are dating or married to a black man? Mm. We'll start with you, Carly. Um, the biggest thing I've learned. Uh oh. Is. How can I say this and not sound racist? <laughs> I think the biggest thing I learned is um, just like the different types of food. Like what? Um, Name two types of food that's different. Uh, I got. The... I mean, is this your husband? What are you. <laughs> Sheesh! Hey, Herm. I already know. Colored green? Right. <laughs> it's done. <laughs> Be because because how long have you been with your boyfriend for? Um, just about a year. In a year, you would know if you're if you're saying food is the one thing, you would know it. You would have a dish to name. I mean, there's no like really different foods that because I've been with him only a year and we knew each other and when we were in like elementary school, so. But you said you said food. I'm sorry. You said food. I don't know. I was just trying to say something. Oh. Clearly. Oh. You got her. What do you love about black people? What do you love about black? Yeah, what do you love about black? <laughs> Cuz I get confused. Um <laughs> fat, no, not fast. What? Um, I do I'm trying to think of it's like basketball. I, oh, love that. Yeah, basketball. Um let, let's finish it out. Leah, what's one thing you've learned from your black boyfriend? I learned actually how to make good grilled chicken. Mm. <laughs> That's all he taught you? He grilled a lot, yeah. And uh, actually, I think the, the other thing, I learned how to be a fighter. So we aggressive? No. <laughs> I'm, I'm joking, I'm joking. I mean like- Is your boyfriend in the NFL? <clears throat> Hmm? No? Okay, they just tend to be a little aggressive sometimes with their women. No, he's not aggressive, just, uh, you know, to... I'm new to United States, yeah. and I face a lot of difficulties. Mm. And uh, he always told me stories like he, f he was facing something and how he went through this. Oh. So, and he's telling me that I need to be more persistent and more, like, stable and just to do what I do and do great. Y'all both from rough places, Ukraine, yeah. he from the hood. Y'all bond off that type of stuff? Yeah. That was good. I would have started with that over the grilled chicken, if I'm being honest. <laughs> that was a much stronger answer. Because you were looking like Carly for a minute. That wasn't a bad answer. I liked it, that. It that was good. But, but grilled chicken or fried chicken? That's, that's why, yeah. No, yeah, but yeah. you don't know what kind of chicken she'd be used to, fam. So it just is a switch up for her. It's a good middle. You know? She said she would be used to fried chicken? No, I'm saying, but maybe she wasn't used to just good seasoned grilled chicken. And then he put her on. I feel you. I feel you. You're right. Old Bay seasoning, anybody ever used it? You see, Sam, Sam is saying that's true. So fast. And she was saying that's true to the grilled right, chicken Sam. thing. My my husband went to culinary school, and I'll go along with the food. We have black eyed peas for New Year's Eve every night. I mean, every year. So. So what's one thing you've learned from being with a black person? Driving. He's he's like. He's, I feel like he's just like, thinks he's in Grand Theft Auto. And How far back does his seat? Really far, really far. Mm -hmm. Hold on. If you were to open his glove box. <laughs> uh. <laughs> what would be in it? That's a good question. You don't have to answer. I mean, I've been driving around without a license for years. Okay, you ain't gotta incriminate yourself on camera. <laughs> Bro, you are mic'd up with five cameras. It's called culture. Um, Sarah? I'd say the biggest thing I learned was a uh, different sense of humor. Mmm. That's a good answer. That's a great answer. That's a great answer. How you mean? Does he relocate when he laughs? <laughs> I wanted, you gotta just ask the question because I wanted her to tell us how black people laugh. That would have been a great question. Uh, I feel like they're more real and white people are more sensitive to it. That's facts. Yeah. Damn. That's facts. Remember, his name is True. True. Hey, she. Sarah, it's adding up for you, girl. That's good. That was good. One black point. <laughs> oh <my>. <laughs> <laughs> one black point to Gryffindor. Okay, last one and we'll eliminate somebody. Katarina, what's one thing you've learned from being with a black boyfriend? A black husband for you. So I've learned not to take y'all to go swim anywhere. Hold on. What? Why not, Katarina? We went together to Costa Rica 
And uh, I said, come on, baby, let's get in the water. And then needless to say, this whole trip ended up in a disaster. Why? Because. He wouldn't take his socks off? No, he, we had to get the lifeguards because the water started sucking him in and it turned into a whole fiasco of help, help. And so it finds That's not a black person problem. That's an ocean problem. He, well, it turns out that he couldn't swim. So that was the whole thing. <laughs> It's not a black issue. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's a black issue. Because then he told me at the end of it, don't you know that we don't swim? He didn't I, say that shit. I can't believe you're saying some shit that's worse than what Zach says. What do you mean? Yeah, then that's crazy. That's crazy. You blaming us for a treacherous current <laughs> overseas? Now you're not going to take us to the beach no more? Caught in a riptide and he... Yeah. How come I did? I was flying then. Huh? How come I made it? Because you know how to swim. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't know. <laughs> Tell us, how come? I, why do you think you were fine? Wait, so if you could go in lifeguard, it means you was on land while he was in the water. No, that's not true. See, now you're turning into something. How'd you get the lifeguard then? That's not what happened. Basically, because we had yelled loud enough that we had caused a commotion. <laughs> why are you whispering? <laughs> Wait, so you was in there with him, and so you was yelling, why didn't you pull him out? I couldn't do it. He's big. How big is he? Pull him out. He's wait, big. Wait, wait. You saying your husband is big. Yeah. But you told us earlier that that was his shirt you have on. So? Yeah, because it's his merch. Let him cook. You're cooking, son. Oh, you can fit that shirt, Denny. Yeah, that's bizarre. Yeah. Because we put it in the dryer. What size is that shirt? It's smaller than it was when I bought it. What was the size when you brought it? It was XL. XL down to small? That's XL, he's 6'2". I'm ready to vote somebody and off. that was his shirt? No, nah, stop it. You ready to vote somebody off? Come on, you kidding me? He was drowning next to her? I felt, I was, I was rocking with you for a I second. I was too, see, he had to ruin it. Listen, I, I... <laughs> <laughs> wait, 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 what? <laughs> I think we can vote Ukraine off. No, 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 no. The only person I'm for sure about is Carly. Yeah. Carly seems super nice, but yeah, the, the no answer when it comes to what you've Crazy. learned. I was the first one, I was put on the spot. But you brought up food. You did go first. Do you have like another answer now to the same question? Like what you've learned being with a black dude? I mean, yeah, I mean, it's more dark humor. Oh, that's a joke in itself, I love it. Hold on, the pun, the pun was crazy in that. Okay, let, let's ask one more question. We'll go this way to give you some time to think about it. What is one pet peeve about your husband that you have? Oh, she has about him. I thought that he drowns. <laughs> <laughs> what are some of your husband's pet peeves? Oh, let me do it again, sorry. What are some of your husband's pet peeves? What annoys your husband? White people, I feel like, annoy him. <laughs> Why would he be with you then? Mm. Well, because, I don't know, I don't classify, I don't think. As white? No. What do you classify <laughs> as? Well, because I get invited to cookouts and stuff. Oh! <laughs> You be on Instagram, huh? What are you bringing to the cookout? Well, I don't have to bring nothing because it's already there. That's crazy. Why? But that's one of the things that- Hold on. You're showing up empty-handed to a black household? Thank you, that's enough. No, it's not enough. <laughs> Wait. You're setting it up. He brings the stuff because his mom comes. Okay, what are y'all bringing then when you go together? We're bringing a whole lot of stuff. Bro, what are we doing? You don't have a black boyfriend. It's yams, yams, sweet potato, chitlins. Oh, oh! Get out of here, I'm leaving. Black beans, oh. rice. Rice? The, yeah, rice. The yellow rice, you yes. Know. You said chitlins? She doesn't have a black boyfriend. Where your boyfriend from again? Why does it matter? It does matter. Where's he from? <laughs> Just answer Where's the guy. Where's the from? Jer he said Jersey. No, 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 that's not her. Jersey was, uh... No, but we met in New Orleans, see? The... So where's he from? He's from New Orleans. He's from New Orleans, but he can't swim? What? Well, who's swimming in the woods? Hurricane Katrina? You're by the ocean. The 05 incident? I don't know though, Chitlins, that is a the southern Chitlins thing. Southern. They don't swim in New Orleans. Why would she act like this yeah, then? No. That's what I'm saying. I think she, know, either she dated somebody black or she be yeah. around black. She knows some black stuff. She knows some black stuff. I don't think we, we need to keep her around. Okay, Sarah, what is one of your uh, boyfriend's pet peeves? Flip flops. Oh, like with the thong you mean? Don't do it. What kind of flip flops though? Any, but especially the old navy ones. Oh, he don't like the slide. He don't put on the slide. He puts the slides on, but not the the toe okay, one. Okay, okay, he's black. He's, he's black. He's black. It's sounding so black. She was actually one of my no, first she picks. Keep, yeah, she, I like her. Yeah, we gotta keep her. Okay, on. Sam. Pet peeve. Yeah, one of your husband's pet peeves. Probably sand at the beach. Damn, that do annoy the f out of me. He keeps his socks on. Mm. 
He probably doesn't even go on the on the sand. <laughs> Black people don't be showing their feet like that. We don't go to the beach, we, bro. We, we got bad feet sometimes. Yeah, and why would we be at the beach? We already tan. I'll be having my toes out. <laughs> Leah, agree. what's uh, one of your boyfriend's pet peeves? Or hu husband? Uh, husband. What's one of your husband's pet peeves? Uh, well, uh, then I ignore his messages. That's just called anxious attachment. Yeah, what? And you just don't like him. I have a habit to put mute, uh, unmute my phone, and then he's texting me and trying to reach me and I'm not available. Leah, you got a side dude? Sir? <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> do you? <laughs> you got a side A piece? second, like a boyfriend and a husband. No. You want one? <laughs> she retracted. Oh, whoa. 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 <laughs> Just husband. <laughs> How long have you been with your husband? Uh, two years. Three hours? <laughs> <laughs> two years. Three, oh, three years? Yeah. Okay. So <laughs> he has bad hearing. It sounded like hours. What, what was the most adventure, adventurous thing you and your husband did? Get married in Vegas. In where? Vegas. In Vegas. In Vegas? Yeah. Okay, Carly, we gave you all the time in the world. What is one of your boyfriend's pet peeves? Um, when hair gets in the shower and like on the bathroom floor, because I don't like want to vacuum it up every day. Speaking of hair, Carly, what kind of hair does your boyfriend have? He kind of has like the style of your hair. It's like faded on the side. Not mine? No. Oh. Oh, oh. No, not yours. She looked, did you see that? I caught a stray for no reason. Just. He's not bald, I'm sorry. It's okay. What do you call this kind of hairstyle? I call it like a mini afro. No, no, no. You said the, the faded on the side. What is that called? Oh, I have no idea. I just call it the fade. She, she called it a mini afro. It's called a taper. If your boyfriend is getting his hair cut, you would know what kind of haircut he got. I don't, I, I don't expect her to know that one. I think I'm ready to get rid of somebody. Okay, I'm gonna put my vote in. Obviously we'll all vote and we'll, you know, whoever has the most amount of votes. I'm ready to send. Leah back. Yeah, that's crazy. I yeah. don't know about that. that. That's my vote. I think Leah is, I think Daniel's a white, I think Daniel's a white guy. I personally would go Carly. I think, I do understand what you saying, bro, about like she maybe fits the demo of a white girl that a black guy would date, but I just don't think she's dating a black guy right now. Mine is uh, Katarina. I think she is. That's racist. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> You've changed your answer a couple times. It's just, I don't know, it didn't sit right with me. This shirt thing was crazy. Okay. Yeah. I would like to go with the first girl. Carly? Yeah, I, I think you might have had a black boyfriend somewhere in your life, but now he is not. Uh, I think he's white. And also, I, I feel like, you know, from the earrings, they don't give me like I have a black boyfriend. Nah. Like, they give me my boyfriends in the country music. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Carly, I know a lot of brothers who would want to snatch you up. Let me yeah. let you know right now. Facts, but I just yeah. think that Facts, right yeah. now, yeah. it's not the one. Wasn't. All right, Carly. <laughs> Thank you, Carly. We're going to send you back. Have a seat. Great job. Bye, Carly. Christian's going to conduct a test on you guys. Go ahead. All right, I dated a half white girl recently. Did you? The one thing I had to teach her was how to dap people up when she meets my friends and family. So I want to give you guys oh, each shit. Hold some on, dap. hold on, let's place you for that. Go at the edge, of, there you go. Why are you looking like you about to fight him? What's up? Uh-huh. Oh, she even Ooh. snapped. I'm telling y'all, she tapped Where in. Where's she going now? What the? God damn. She wasn't even laughing. She weird, but she tapped in. Yo, she snapped at the exact same millisecond you did. I'm trying to tell y'all, she's the ringer. All right. What's happening? What's happening? How you feeling? <laughs> nope. Nope. Okay, no, maybe not. No. So on the No, she went in for the hug. I didn't give it to her, but she went in for it. That was not bad. Oh. She committed it to the bit, the though. same, but there's a different scale here, obviously. Hey, what's up? Hi, this is not how I go to my husband, though, but. <laughs> oh, she cool, bro, she cool. She a cool white lady. Leah, let's see what you got. Mm. Nope. She ain't never hugged a black. <laughs> she looked at the hand. She was like, let me make sure I do it the right. <laughs> that was Leah's first ever dap up yeah, on camera. For sure. <laughs> that was the first time she dapped up another human being. And I'm happy we got it on camera for you. I'm going to send you the clip. It was so fun to do the hand stuff with the black guy. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you learn from that? <sighs> All right. So. In the, and obviously we're working off a different scale here, right? I don't expect right. him to give me the same kind of dat. As a real black, for sure. Right, as a real black person would. But, so, if I'm gonna rank him from most authentic dat, yeah. it's gonna Ka be- Katarina, absolutely. For sure, one, then 
Sam and Sarah are kind of tied for a second, to be honest. Like Sarah's was terrible. No, no, it no. wasn't. It wasn't. Cause she, I just didn't meet her halfway with the hugs. Hers was great. Leah was third, sorry. But Sam might be a little better than Sarah's, but Sarah's was yeah. cool though. I think Sarah had the best one. Here's why. To me, Katarina, hear me out. Katarina felt like she was just, she definitely has a lot of black energy, but she's just trying really hard. Sarah no. was, no. <laughs> Sarah was trying, but she's not familiar with it. Sam, to me, looked the most familiar with the action. Not perfect, but she looked the most comfortable doing it. Leah and Sarah, to me, looked uncomfortable. Sam looked the le most comfortable. But let me tell you right now, though, Sarah still gave one that, like, she just hasn't done this in a minute, but she's been done it enough to have learned what times. it is, okay. right? I, I don't think y'all understand the difficulty of the snap in unison. The right. fact that she did that in unison, I know a lot of my white homies that I kick it with who ain't doing that. Most to me, <laughs> she's been around black people. If she's coming and she already knew to do it, nobody told her to do that. She knew to that's snap true. at the that's end. I just, can I ask, do, do black women in general dap up? Um, that's a genuine question. They just know how. They, they can dap up their, their homies, their brothers, their uncles. They just know how to do it. We eliminate one more off that dap. Really? Yeah. Is that enough? Yeah, we have to. We're eliminating somebody Leah. right now. Leah. Leah gotta go. Leah. Based off the dap. Yeah. The dap was crazy. Go. Leah, we're gonna send you back. You're making a huge mistake. All right, the next round's about family. What was the, we'll start with you, Sarah. What was the interaction like meeting your boyfriend's family? It was really um, loud. <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah. Very um, affectionate and yeah, very loving. Yeah, yeah. He comes from a really good family, so. Yeah. Bro, her answers are crazy. It's her or Sam, bro. Okay, Sam, what was it like meeting your husband's family? One side of his family is very animated and crazy. They're from Louisiana. And the other side are super chill and very like kind of serious and, you know, so. What, is, uh, what does your husband do for work? He's in production. He's an AD in reality. Nice. Uh, Sarah, what does your boyfriend do for work? He's actually a talent agent. <laughs> Katarina, how was it like meeting your husband's family? Well, I mean, obviously I passed the test if I made it to the cookout, right? Okay, take it easy, Katarina. <laughs> no one's questioning your black activity. Yeah, one of my cousins will want to fight her. What, uh, what does your husband do? Um, he's in music. What kind of music? Um, a couple kinds of different kinds of music. It's a couple kinds of different yes, kinds of music? Yes, because it's blending. The genres are blending now. Katarina, how long have you been with your man for? Um, about a year. About a year. What kind of looks and energy do you get from black women when they see y'all together? Well, how long? Because it depends. Like, once we start talking, they love me. But, like, in the beginning, I definitely have to, like, go through, a, a, like, a, like, some moments. It's some moments. What about, what about you, Sarah? Um, they give the look, they give the up and down, but you know, I keep my peace. I just, something was weird about that conversation with Katarina. I thought you were married to your husband. You asked me how long I was with him. But you said you were married and you only been with him for a year? You didn't say when did we get married? When did you get married? You should have, that's what you should, I think you should, they should have gotten her to ask it when they got married. Are you talking about the date? When did you guys get married? What do you mean? I told you a year ago. You, you scratch something every time you lie. Year. That's not true at all. <laughs> <laughs> That's a sign. If you and your husband don't work out, I know a guy named Latrell, y'all would love each other. I would keep you for content purposes, but I'm trying to win the game. I think we gotta vote her She's all. She's different. Yeah. I'm different and I'm different. See, this was the bounce part of it. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry, Sarah. Wait, real quick, before, what's your uh, Instagram handle? <laughs> <laughs> all right, we gotta vote for someone off. Are we, are we Katarina, we all in agreement? All right, Katarina, have a seat, you did great. I'm gonna call my black husband on y'all too. All right, we're down to our last this two. Is this is hard. This is the two I thought from the beginning, I will say that. Same. Just off looks. So he, here's where I'm at, and we'll all take our turns here, but mm -hmm. to me, Sam, to me, gives me the most she has a black husband energy, but Sarah gave all the right answers. But oh. she gives me black boyfriend energy. Like she may have had a black boyfriend in, in the, the past. past. S Sam gives me like current. Y'all sleeping on the fit, bro. They're both set. What? Sam's fit. What about it is blacker than- Dude, the shoes, the way the jeans are rolled up, I'm telling you. 
I could agree. The hoop earrings, I, either Latino or black boy. I have friend. one thing. One is named Richard, the other is true. Oh, I think right. the black guy is you. <laughs> Sam, yes. if you were to plan your husband's birthday, what would you do? What would it look like? I mean, what would I do for him? Probably like a backyard party with all of his friends, you know? He's or homies. Like, yeah, I don't, he's got like an old school crew, so I would, I would definitely, I would, would that's what he would want to do. They're both standing equally as comfortable. But would you ever refer to your white husband as an old school crew? I think just because you're white and you date a black man, that doesn't mean that she would just necessarily say his slang. She still talks. Like, For sure. You know, you her people. Uh, how'd your family feel about you marrying a black man? Ooh. Damn, that pause. That felt real though, right? Yeah. It took him a minute. Elaborate a little bit, like how long? Well, I'd never had a black boyfriend or husband, obviously, before him, so yeah. It... Did your family come to your wedding? Yeah, oh, yeah. All of them did? All of them, yep. Mm. So they're, and they're supportive now? Yeah, oh, yeah. Sarah, can we just ask you that? How did your family feel about your black boyfriend? I know you're not married, but... Well, my mom was really excited, and then my dad was a little hesitant. Mm. That's on brand? Yeah, mm. he's conservative. <laughs> Okay, how'd you get him to come along, or was that True? Just spent more time. Yeah, well it was, yeah, it was both of us. I mean, True really took the reins on that because he was like, I'm gonna make this man love me, so. The question I was gonna ask, Sam, you kinda already just answered part of it. Uh, Sarah, before True, was your last boyfriend white before him? What's the biggest difference you noticed between dating that white dude and dating him? Um, basically everything, there's nothing really similar, so. Okay. Sorry, Zach. Sorry, Zach. <laughs> <laughs> that too. Oh, God damn. Okay. That's oh. the biggest difference. Woo! I True putting it on you? Sorry? True putting it on you? Yeah. My boy. Uh, she did not hesitate. So fast. Wow. I don't even think you got your question out fully. No, that was crazy. Okay, we gotta, we gotta make our decision. I don't know. We're all going together. If we all go together, I'm totally fine with picking um, Sam. But we'll just individually vote, and okay. whoever has the highest vote besides her, we'll start with you, man. Oh like, how man, you why you do me? Um, damn, that, that her last answer threw us off. Why? I don't know. It was very stereotypical, and it, that, like she was doing good the whole time, and then the last answer is just like that's just just too perfect. But I'm gonna go Sam. I, I'll go. I'll go Sarah. I know it's not gonna be picked, but you know, that's what that's what I felt. I'll go. Uh, I think that Sarah. I think that everything you said is authentic. You know about black people, our humor, that we loud. I know you've been around True <laughs> and he exists and you've been around his family. I just don't think you're with him currently. So I'm gonna go ahead with Sam. She's married, obviously. It seems like she's locked in with her husband, Richard. I'm gonna say Sarah because Sam's been with Richard longer. There's a bigger chance they're not together anymore. This whole video, Sam's given me the same energy that my fiance gives me. Mm. Like, it just feels like someone who's very open to black culture in the most respectful way possible. She's staying true to who she is. The family thing I totally understand. I don't know, she just feels so comfortable. The swagger to me, that's how Eileen kind of dresses. Earrings, the slick back hair. Yeah, maybe, maybe I'm letting my own experiences cloud my judgment. Uh, I'm gonna go with Sam is, is married to a black man. I'm the tiebreaker, so I'm kind of scared, but f bring him back. All right, we voted Sam three to two, split panel, as a person who is with a black man. Will the real person who's with a black person step forward? Mm. 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 Oh. Oh. Oh, wait, they looking at each other. Come on now. Yes! Come on now! Let's go. <sighs> okay, just tell us, did you order that shirt for this video? No, see, this is you trying stuff again. No, this was my husband's shirt. She said her black husband dr almost drowned. Yeah, that was pretty bad. <laughs> yeah. That's the only part he remembered. Is that some killer stuff? He's giving me school shoes. I'm You're giving me school. <laughs> I do. I do agree with all the day's work. Good night. My bag and I gotta brag. I do this shit for real. When we was down and we had nothing, we had to share a meal. We put the shit in overdrive with no steering wheel. Put your hands up. up. Yo, That's enough, Kevin Lane, Kevin Linguini. <laughs>
How does she know my full name? Wait a minute. 